Welcome back, chemistry enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the world of chemistry to explore the fascinating p-block elements. Whether you're a student just starting to learn chemistry or someone who needs a quick refresher, this video is for you. We'll break down the basics of the p-block elements in a simple and easy to understand way. So, let's jump right in and demystify these essential elements. What are the p-block elements? The periodic table is divided into several blocks based on the electron configuration of the elements. The p-block elements are found on the right side of the periodic table and include elements from group 13 to group 18. These elements have their outermost electron in the p-orbital, hence the name p-block. Characteristics of the p-block elements The p-block elements exhibit a wide range of properties, making them incredibly diverse and important. Here are some key characteristics. Metalloids, some p-block elements, such as boron, silicon, germanium, arsenic, antimony, and tellurium, exhibit properties of both metals and nonmetals. They are known as metalloids. Nonmetals, elements like nitrogen, oxygen, fluorine, and chlorine are nonmetals found in the p-block. They generally have low melting and boiling points and are poor conductors of electricity. Metals, the p-block also contains metals like aluminum, gallium, indium, and thallium. These metals usually have low melting points and are quite soft. Groupwise understanding. Group 13, boron group, this group includes boron, aluminum, gallium, indium, and thallium. These elements have three electrons in their outermost shell. Group 14, carbon group, this group includes carbon, silicon, germanium, tin, and lead. Carbon, the key element in this group, has the unique ability to form long chains and rings, making it the basis of all organic compounds. Group 15, nitrogen group, this group includes nitrogen, phosphorus, arsenic, antimony, and bismuth. Nitrogen, the key element in this group, is essential for life and is a major component of the Earth's atmosphere. Group 16, calcogens, this group includes oxygen, sulfur, selenium, tellurium, and polonium. Oxygen, the key element in this group, is vital for respiration and the most abundant element in the Earth's crust. Group 17, halogens, this group includes fluorine, chlorine, bromine, iodine, and astatine. These elements are highly reactive and are often found in compounds rather than in their pure form. Group 18. Noble gases. This group includes helium, neon, argon, krypton, xenon, and radon. Noble gases are generally inert and have a full outer shell, making them very stable and unreactive. Applications of P-block elements. Silicon used extensively in electronics and solar panels. Not nitrogen used in the production of ammonia. A key component of fertilizer is Fluorine used in the production of Teflon and in water fluoridation carbon. The basis of organic chemistry, essential for life. We hope this video has shed some light on the basics of the P-block elements. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more chemistry content. See you in the next video.